Hi Pisces, this is Jackie Talman. This is your general reading for the week of November 23rd, 2020. Thank you guys for stopping by and as always, if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, subscribe, retweet. I greatly appreciate it. Happy Thanksgiving everyone. And if you're seeking a psychic reading, please contact me at JackieTomlin.com or find a link to those readings in this video below. In the description box below this video offers those readings and everything I do offer. Pisces, this is a time to voice your opinion, but be warned there is something there that flares up your temper. Just very brief and passing, just want to put that out there. Expect some positive changes in your home life. You are taking authority. You are setting the tone to how things are going to be. You're grateful and counting your blessings. There is a new emotional path. Um, and there's something that's a little disappointing to you. But what I want to say to that is hold on to your goals. They're, they're closer than what you realize. So I want to start your reading today with uh, three angel messages. They're going to move right into the cards. Okay. So, three angel messages for my Pisces for the week of November 23rd, 2020. Pisces, first angel message, divine timing. Y'all know me, guys. I'm all big about it's all about the timing. Next angel card. Believe in yourself. Something we are often forget to do is to stop and believe in yourself. And you're under the guidance of Archangel Michael. Love seeing that. Let Michael lead the way for you guys this week. All right, so let's move on with your tarot reading. This is Pisces for your week on November 23rd, 2020. Want to remind you your tarot week videos are up already. Pisces, we're starting with the King of Wands. You taking authority, like I said, putting your foot down, being true to you, saying I will no longer do this, this, and this. We're going to do things this way from now on. Also representing an Aries. With that, we have the Emperor. This is a dominant, control, take type take charge type person coming in to you for an unexpected offer of assistance. And with that, we have the Ten of Swords energy. Someone has done you wrong. Someone's done you wrong in the past. Let this energy go because it's actually holding you back. Bury it, Pisces. Leave the past in the past. It's holding you back. Next, I have the Eight of Cups. Same thing. It's okay to look in the past. Do not get stuck in the past energy. Okay? It's going to hold you back if you do. Moving forward, it's going to be a quick moving week. This is the Knight of Swords showing something is coming rushing in. What's rushing in is the Wheel of Fortune. This is the wheel that the wheel is finally turning into your favor. Things are going your way. Six of Coins, financial balance. Also helping out someone else financially. You could also be lending your time or maybe tithing to something. But it is financial balance. Then we have the Six of Swords telling you the worst of it's over. The worst of it's over. The, the best is yet to come. So please, guys, let go of all this past ick I see you've got going on here. And we end with that Nine of Coins, which is financial independence. Also could represent planning of a trip, holding on to your goals, doing something nice for yourself. Beautiful. All right, Pisces, we're moving over to my deck. This is The Elemental Awakening. This is also available on my website, and you'll find a link to that in the description box below this video. So, Pisces, 
what you need to know for that week on November 23rd. We're going to go a little bit further with it. Pisces, next new beginning is occurring in the spring. Being used by someone. And there again, Pisces, I don't think that's currently. I think it's that past energy that you keep bringing forward. Look at there. Power in that water. You will get what you want. Hold on to those goals. Keep pushing forward. Commitment vows living together. What you want there is in the reach. Okay, now to my single Pisces, this is telling you something new is coming in. Okay, this could very well lead to a committed relationship for you. But for those Pisces that are already in a relationship, this is relationships going to the next level. And this is a major arcana in this deck. Fear and worries are leaving. There's a good business deal in hand. Also, Major Arcana, get ready for a fast pace. Again, what the love life, intense relationships, true love. Any delays you're experiencing at this time are in your favor. There is an Aries energy surrounding you. That's Aries has appeared in this reading twice. There's new money coming in. Endings and or closure. And that's coming in on a major comment as well. Pisces, you've got a beautiful reading ahead. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget, I go live every Wednesday night, 7 p.m. Eastern. Feel free to join me. Uh, don't forget to check out your dailies as well. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.